Hey guys, how are you going? My name is Dom and today I would like to demonstrate the usage of the CSS REM unit. So this one is especially useful because um, it is relative to the roots level element or in other words the HTML element. Okay, so we have here the same example um, as the one in the EM unit video. We have a regular unordered list. So we're going to change the font size of, um, of these list item tags to be relative to the font size of the HTML tag. Okay, so inside my editor here, let's go ahead and change the font size of the HTML element, so the root element, to be something like 12px. So it is currently 16px, and that's set by default by the actual browser. We're just going to explicitly say um, it's going to be 12px. Okay, so I can save this and then refresh my browser and we get this right here. So now we can use the REM unit to set the ally tags to be two times the font size of the root element. Okay, so let's go back inside here and make a new rule for the ally tags. We can say font size of 2rem. So I can now save this and refresh, and now the computed font size for these ally tags is 24px. So 2 times 12, which is um, obviously 24. So that is the basic usage of the REM unit. And this is especially useful, as I said, because you set the font size um, in one place, and then everything else changes based on that. So if you're developing a website for, let's just say, four weeks, and you think, oh, let's change the font size to make it a bit smaller. If you use this unit, you can change it in one place and the rest of your website is gonna be affected by that single change. Okay, so that right there is the CSS REM unit. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.